Hi, I'm Andrew with Baker's Gas. We're here today with the all-new Miller Venture 150S. So this is what we've been waiting for. Finally got our demo unit in. Um, this Venture 150 is the new battery pack welder by Miller. Um, so you can see I got a slew of accessories out here. I'm going to go through them in this video. We're going to weld with it. We're going to talk about its capability and uh, just run you through the basics of this machine. So right here, so combined with the battery, the machine is 26 and a half pounds. So really not very heavy at all. So you can see other competitors, we're talking some are 50, some are 25, so right in that ballpark. So I got a battery right here. This is the brunt of the weight of the machine itself. So in your package, you get a battery, the charger, the machine, and you get a ground and a stick thing. But battery is pretty, pretty light. I mean, it's not, it's not too bad. Um, it comes with little feet that you got to snap on and they go on the top as well. So those are grips that you can you got to put those on. There is some assembly required with the stick electrode and ground clamp, but nothing, nothing major. Um, so on this battery, these are removable batteries. So in the industry, everybody wanted, they saw the battery welders and they're like, well, those are awesome, but I wish I could just plug a battery in. Well, this is it. You just plug it in um, and then you just change it out. So longevity wise, you can have two batteries, you just keep going. Um, this is your charging system. This is a battery I got on charging right now. You can see the, the lights blinking. It's on fast charge right now. So fast charge will get it up to 95% in 30 minutes. Slow charge will get it up to 95% in less than 60 minutes. So fairly quick charging system. Um, really super easy to use. And actually just I'll show you right now. Just push on that little button. Clicks off. Comes with the custom. I got it plugged into 110. And you just slide it in. And there it is, it's charging. So super simple to use. The little inverter here that's running it. And I'll show you here on the on the machine. It's, this is super easy to do too. So this thing's really, really light. You look on the side, there's an arrow. You just line it up with the unlock. And you just slide it forward until it double clicks, and then you're good to go. So this says engineered for welding. So this battery is specifically engineered for high output arc starts and longevity as far as welding time. Um, so Miller engineered it. It is specifically used for welding only, right? So it's not like some tool battery or some other type of battery, but this thing is engineered for welding. And that's where Miller kind of shines in that avenue. Plus you can change them out, swap them out, put another battery in. Now on the front of the machine here, we've got our positive, negative. We'll turn this thing on. So you got a little LCD display on there. Um, got our amperage display. So stick welding, we go up to 150 amps. TIG welding, we go up to 160 amps. Um, and then you just hit menu, right? Stick. So you basically your 7018. This thing is 6010 capable. So you can run 6010 with this. And obviously, it, can TIG weld as well. Um, process settings, and then you can go down to system settings, and then you just go to back, and it gives you back. So it's telling me I'm at 100% charged. I'm on 7018, 150 amps. Pretty sweet USB port here for updating purposes. Uh, pretty awesome. Now, let me just shut it down here, and I'll show you how easy it is to unlatch. So you just, that front button, push in, comes right off. Super easy. So that little button controls the two locking mechanisms right here. Super simple. Thing slides right in, not hard at all. And it makes it super light. It comes with the strap, shoulder strap. This is actually a three-point hook too as well. You can see on the top, we can hook, put tie a rope, pull it up from that. This is actually a lifting point for this unit. Um, so super nice. So everyone's asking though, how many stick electrodes can I get out of it? So, as far as 7018 goes, you can get 13 332nd 7018s, and then you can get 8 1 8 7018 stick electrodes out of it. Um, that's in one charge on this battery here. Now, if you get two batteries, though, obviously you can double that output. Um, and we'll link all these parts down below and show them. And then another great thing about these is that the battery has a thousand charge warranty, so a thousand charges or one year, whatever comes first. And then if you get a warranty battery within that first year, right, something drastically goes wrong or something happens and 
you can't get to a thousand charges and it goes bad, you, you get a new battery, you get a one year warranty on that new battery as well. So pretty sweet. Three year warranty on the machine itself, uh, not the battery, just the machine. And then obviously the inverter, this here, the charging port portion. Uh, if this gets damaged or anything, you can buy each one of these separately. So you can buy them as a package or you can buy them separately. So that makes it easier if you lose your charger, break your charger, bust the plug, you can just buy that separately. You don't have to go back and buy the whole kit. Um, let's try this thing out. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to run uh, some 7018 and some 6010. We're going to try it. So on the 6010 output, it's a little bit higher, so a little bit more than the 7018. So you can get 14 332 6010 and you can get like 9 6010 1 8 inch. So a little bit higher than the 718, but we're going to give it a shot. Let's try it out. All right, so we got our machine set up, got our lead set up. I got some 718 here. Got my machine in. We're going to turn it down to 120 amps. Give that a shot. Smooth, arc start was real smooth. Yeah, chipped right off there, turned out really, really nice. That was at 120 amps. What did we lose on the battery? We only lost 7% on the battery, so that's not too bad. Let me uh, jump down in the menu here. We're going to try 6010. 85. 85 amps, I got. I got a 330 second 6010, and this is the red rod, so it's a little bit harder to start. We're going to see if we can start it up. Give it a shot here. Sweet. So I ran that pretty good. Um, my fault when it stopped there a couple times. I kind of long arced it, but that's okay. I uh, pulled out of the puddle a little bit. Um, you know, it ran it really, really nice. Started pretty good. Not really any trouble on the arc. I mean, just real smooth, laid it out there. We only lost 5% on that battery, so that was in a lost 5%. That was one stick electrode, so not too bad, but like I said, you can get about 13, 14, 332 60 10s, and then I was around 8 inch, 718, so you can get about 8 of those all the way. Yeah, ran super smooth. Um, so check it out down below. We're going to list all the packages, all the bundles down below. So we got a baker's bonus, we got that bundle, so we offer a discount on the secondary battery. Um, so we're going to link all that down below. If you guys got any questions, comments, Leave them down there and uh, we'll do our best to answer them. Thanks again for watching. Stay tuned for some more.